Here we are doing our experiment on the in vitro bottle in Lausanne, Switzerland. This is the computer. It puts in a flow waveform that is uh, cerebral spinal fluid pulse that's measured in a patient with TRA malformation, you can see here. And then this pump moves according to the waveform. And then the pump is lubricated by some oil. You can see the oil there in the syringe so it doesn't get stuck. And then the oil is on top of some water in a little kind of beaker. And then the water goes through a tube into the MRI scanning room. It's called a waveguide. So, and of course you have the MRI itself. And then in the MRI room, the flow comes in to the model. And then the model is there actually inside of a little cage, which is a head coil that helps uh, improve the signal in the MRI. And you can't see the model right now, but I have one here in my hand that's similar. Um, so it's a little bit hard to see, not focusing very well. But this model is representative of a Chiari patient. So the top of it, actually on the left, is where the brain would be, and on the right is where further down in the spine is. And we're looking at the flow field around the spinal cord and then also the nerve roots in this in detail. So there it is, our in vitro experiment.